Hi folks, Dr. Bob McCauley, um, vitamin C, what a boring supplement, everyone thinks vitamin C, vitamin C. Really uh, a very fascinating uh, supplement. The reason is, is because we need vitamin C so badly. Um, you know, um, vitamin C is ascorbic acid. So when a human, uh, human being is first formed with a sperm and an egg and you get this spark of life, the first thing it does is produce ascorbic acid. So interesting, it's the, mo it's the most fundamental molecule that is known to the human body. And um, ascorbic acid is the miracle molecule. I could write a whole book on this because, um, you know, uh, ascorbic acid is the only um, molecule in the universe that we know of that can both receive and give an electron. There's no, either you receive electrons or you give them, but you, this will do both. So a very unique um, nutrient, and uh, you know it's kind of just. I don't want to say it's ignored because people say it's vitamin C. It's good for colds. It's good to build the immune system. Uh, it's good for everything from colds to cancer. You name it. I mean, it's got everything in. You know, it addresses everything because it's so fundamental to our well-being and you'll have a lot of problems if you don't have vitamin C. You get those from a lot of fresh fruits. Uh, you'll see vitamin C everywhere. It's all over the place. It's um, Once you've extracted something or maybe of course you cooked it, you're going to see this is not very available anymore and you're going to find that most of it's gone. It's not there. So it's best to get from, get from fruits and vegetables. This is just ascorbic acid. Um, there, there's all you know. People talk about rose hips. That's got vitamin C. If you want to go with the natural form, is no, no. That's great. Vitamin C is amla is a really good one. I do sell amla, uh, which is a fruit from India. He, it's got loaded with vitamin C, but really, really an incredible nutrient. Uh, what it does for the human body. If you do get a serious illness such as cancer or something else like that. You know, you really want to load up on this stuff. You're not going to be, it's water soluble, so you can't take too much vitamin C. You could take up to six grams a day. Always spread that out through the day so that, you know, your body's always absorbing a little bit of it. Um, and it's a better way to take it than just all at once. But it wouldn't hurt you if you did, but it's more effective when you just take it a little bit at a time. So, you know, not much to say about vitamin C. You could. I could go on with the health benefits of vitamin C for, you know, 10 minutes or whatever. It's got so many different, you know, new, you know, value, value, value so much value to it. But hey, um, main thing is like all supplements, don't worry, you just put it into your body and your body will know what to do with it. That's the, it doesn't know what to do with Doritos. It doesn't know what to do with a pizza. It doesn't know what to do with bread. These are just fillers. It really doesn't know what to do. It just kind of lets it pass through because what else happens? You put something in your body that really doesn't belong there, and you've got a some kind of an immune response, meaning it's inflammatory because that's what happens. And the body recognizes it doesn't. When something goes into the body, and the body doesn't recognize it, well, it kind of it, it causes an inflammatory response, and that means your immune system's working. It's like like really one of the only uh, you know reactions the body knows is inflammation. And um, so if you keep getting a lot of inflammation, it's because you keep eating garbage and stuff that doesn't belong in your body. So what would I do in that kind of a case? Well, I'd stop eating crap because I eat mostly raw fruits and vegetables. Just remember, God grew an apple. We made a frying pan. And you can't improve on God's creation, right? Come on. This is pretty simple stuff, but nobody wants to look at it that way. I know it tastes, I know, I, you know, an apple is incredible, but uh, apple pie tastes great. We all want that, and we get these masters that really can make it. I've told you one time, I had a, a, a raw apple pie made with real apples, and I, they made that in 10 minutes right in front of me, and it was absolutely delicious. So there's so many ways to prepare these foods. But um, hey, vitamin C, fruits and vegetables, eat a lot of them. Amla, a really, really good one, extremely high in vitamin C. And if you just want to, you just get like ascorbic acid and take that. It'll be very effective. But I'm big into vitamin C. Dr. Bob, see you guys next time. I just want to remind you to buy my books. I've got uh, eight books on natural health, uh, one on cancer, one on silver, one on water, some other ones. I've been writing books now, believe it or not, 25 years. And uh, go to Amazon.com. 
or Audible. I've got them all on Audible or go to BobMcCauleyBooks.com. But buy my books, please, and review them.